What's going on everybody? The Original Mako back with some more Vampire Survivors content and today we got some stuff about the new character. I'm gonna have an entire game showcasing the new character and before we get into it I'm gonna show you guys the new weapon and how to upgrade the new weapon because it's not quite as obvious as in previous cases. So, before we get into it, be sure to check the links down below. As always, if you want to see me do some Vampire Survivors Runs Live or a bunch of other really cool, fun games and be a part of an awesome community, be sure to check out the Twitch link. We have a lot of fun over there. I stream all the time, so I might be streaming right as you're watching this. Come check me out. I would really appreciate it. It would mean a lot. Also, hit the subscribe button, turn on notifications, because we are just going to be pumping out content for a while especially uh, coming up in these next couple months. We got a lot of stuff to get through. All these game demos that are out right now, there's so much content with those and, and it's it's just nonstop. So make sure you hit the subscribe button so you don't miss anything. But let's go ahead and get into talking about this new character and um, exactly how you get the new... Or, the new weapon comes with the character, but how you uh, upgrade the new weapon and evolve it to its final form. So... Um, let me go to my unlocks here so I can show you guys exactly how to get the new character. It's pretty easy, uh, pretty straightforward, just like unlocking literally every character in the game. Um, where was this one at? Oh, God. Is it not on the screen? Oh, maybe it was just lower. Hold up. Maybe I actually, it's below Arcanus, possibly. It's not. Regardless, it's one of the characters you unlock by opening up a coffin in... Oh, oh, here it is. It just doesn't show you the character. There it is. So you unlock, uh, find and open the coffin in the Capella Manga. Magna. Close enough to Manga. Um, which is this new map right uh, here. It'll basically be straight down. You go down, kill all the guards, open the coffin, boom, you have the new character. It's the same way you've unlocked characters uh, for a while, most likely. When you get that new character, you'll see, wow, what is this? It looks like the whip. Well, it's very similar to the whip, but it's only, it's, it's single directional instead of multi-directional. And it kind of feels like a whip machine gun. Oh God, my elbow, a whip machine gun instead of a whip, like just a normal whip, I guess is the way to describe it. Uh, but this character gets plus 0.5% might projectile speed duration and area every level. So Every time you level up for the entire game, you're getting a pretty significant bonus. Now, it takes a few levels before you start to notice this, but eventually you do start to notice it, and it starts to get uh, pretty pretty hefty. So, it is a pretty good character. Um, but, how do we get the upgraded version of this weapon? Well, first, in order to get the evolved version of this weapon, you have to, uh, I believe... Oh, wait, no, that's how you just unlock this weapon in general. But in order to get the upgraded version of this weapon... You have to do um, this challenge right here. Uh, unite the Vento Sacro and the Bloody Tear. So, you might be thinking, what the hell? It's This works the exact same way as the birds, as the uh, guns to get the laser beams. You have to get the whip evolved. So, you have to evolve the whip and have the Vento Sacro, which is this new whip, at maximum level. Once this is at 8, and you have the upgraded version of the whip, you have it already evolved in your inventory, then the next chest you unlock has a chance to give you this upgraded version, which is kind of crazy. Um, you'll get to see it in the gameplay, but that is how you evolve it, and that is what the new character does. So I guess without further ado, let's hop into some gameplay. Thank you guys so much for the support as always. Hopefully you enjoy the gameplay. Um, let me know down below your thoughts on this new character. Ah, I'm not sure how I feel yet. Obviously with all the new characters, we'll be having another tier list coming pretty soon. Um, but regardless, let me know your thoughts down below. Enjoy the gameplay. Thank you guys so much for all the support as always. Hopefully you all have a wonderful rest of your day. I love each and every one of your faces and I will catch you all in the next video. This new character, new map. Although, if I'm being honest, I feel like it's going to be hard to beat the new map with this character. This character is not very good. We'll use this character's soundtrack, too, because it bangs. I'll try it. I mean... We could...
That would get plus three on the whip. Is that worth it? Is that better than having the revives, though? Wait, Toronto's box isn't on this map? What the hell? Oh, fuck. I have no idea how to get Toronto's box. It's fine. I feel like Awake is probably just better, but... <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> Let's let it ride. Let's go, baby. Well, there you go. Now we get the whip off the rip, too. Oh, God, get away. Please, you guys are so scary. Where are all the... Okay, the necklaces are all down there. Yeah, turn his box isn't on the map. Oh, oh, so it's something that drops? But you, it says you could get it to level 9. I, I don't know. I'm confused. I'm confused, and I'm scared. I kind of want to do a pretty similar build to last time. Just instead of... Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I know what I want to do. Uh, Laurel or this first? Probably this first. So it's a power-up that drops. But once it drops, you can level it up. Unlike the other power-ups. Oh, God. I'm... There's so... This game just pumps out content like it's a, a mother's breast milk or something. Jesus. That was quick for the two guns. Love to see that. Now let's get some passives rolling, eh? Oh, okay. So it just it would appear here. I I I now think I understand what you're saying. So it's just something that can pop up here. It's not going to be on the ground, but it can pop up here. Right. Okay. 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 I see. It's all cleared up now. We're all on the same page. Okay, we have, um, we're about two minutes into the game. We have no passives. Come on, baby. Can we get something going, please? No. No, we can't. What are the passives? Okay, so we don't need to get Tier Gasu. We can all we'll have that naturally. We don't need to get Duplicator, and we don't need... I think that's... Is that Spellbinder? I don't know. But we don't need Tier Gasu or Duplicator. We can get that later. So we can get some other stuff. Get like oh my god they're getting bigger. You get like spinach. Uh, we can get we can probably get bracer. But the only two weapons we now are gonna be able to get is Laurel and Laurel and um, Lancet. I mean, I want to get this upgraded as soon as possible, but I also, I also want to get the guns upgraded as soon as possible because that's what I feel like is going to even remotely get us through this. Because once we have the upgraded Laurel and Lancet, it, it, I'm not concerned about winning. Uh, it's getting there that I'm concerned about. Fuck. We're three minutes in, and we have no passives. 
That might be the longest I've gone without getting any passives. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. The journey continues. I feel like this thing should also be dead. This thing is tanking so hard. This is so crazy. Yeah, me too. I like the I like the enemy design in this map. The journey continues. This is so crazy to me. I don't understand. Hey, there it is. Okay. So it's a cursed item, but it increases might, projectile speed, and duration duration and area by 4%. I mean, I have to get it to level 9, and we have a couple of extra passive slots. So I don't know if getting increased curse this early is a great idea. What are we at? 60%? What does this give us? Oh, it still says 60%. Oh, God. That makes me even more scared, if I'm being honest. Weapons, baby. It's just all weapons. Jesus. Yeah, let's fully max it out. Fuck it. I guess. That's what this game wants me to do. Damn it, I'll do it. I'm not afraid. This map just does not spawn a ton of enemies. It's hard to get levels going quickly. I mean, five minutes in, level 20 is not great, like, compared to other maps. It's not like I'm not getting a ton of the XP. It's just... No, 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 blue guy. I'd appreciate if you stay away for now. And now these bats are going to be so damn hard to kill. Hey, <laughs> hey, <laughs> yep. There's another thing, another weapon. Uh, what do I have guides on? Whoa, my bad. And there's the whip finished. Okay. <laughs> Those two are now level eight. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna need to snag those crosses when we get the, when we hopefully get Mad Groove as our second, um, Second, whatchamacallit, because we can now no longer grab the cross that's below us. So we need to hopefully just get lucky and find one. Dude, these enemies tank. Like, look. Look at how hard it is to kill them, and now there's no XP. Now it's so hard to level up. There's a bunch of XP down here we can't get anymore. Oh, this map's a pain in my penis. Well, there's at least a passive we needed. We have a wake, right? So we have... Oh no, we didn't get a wake. We got the other thing. Shit! Ah, oh, god, that makes this even worse. I'll buy one golden egg. Oh. It's damage. Plus 0.1 damage needs to carry me. 
Oh, I need that chicken. Yeah, I think we're screwed. Uh, I'm fairly certain we're screwed. If I could make it to 10 minutes and get the evolved whip, maybe we're fine? But making it to 10 minutes is not... I feel like the eggs would affect the current round, but I'm not positive at all. Where are the passives? We are seven minutes into the game. I haven't seen Tome. I haven't seen uh, I, duplicators on the map, so I wouldn't take it. I haven't seen Duplicator. I haven't seen Tiragasu. I haven't seen Spinach. The fuck? What am I playing? This map just does not give enough XP out. And it doesn't... This map does not work well for the new character because it's so... Oh, hey. There we go. It's so side to side. Like the weapon is. And the map's so vertical. <laughs> so it's the exact opposite of what you want, really. Hey! Oh! You can upgrade before 10 minutes. Let's go! Now we can start healing. So maybe we do have a chance, actually. Once again, we're going to need to get a lot luckier with these level ups, though. I mean, we just need we just need way more XP than what we're getting. We are getting, like, no XP. I can play a lot more Reckless, though, so that's something. Hopefully that'll help a bit. Yep, hello, sir. All this XP we're leaving behind, we are gonna get eventually when we get the the mad the the mad groove, I believe. Um, kind of want to re-roll this. I uh, so I'm going to. Uh, what do we need? Tirgasu, we can get off the ground. Duplicator, we can get off the ground. We need Tome. That's it. We just we need the tome, so yeah, Candle Labrador's free free reign. We could finish up these passives. Then when we get Mad Groove, we'll be able to actually use it. Okay, this should be the upgraded weapon, right? All right, let's see. Let's see how this works here. A Union uh, critical hits might generate explosions. F what the hell was it called? F -f 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 That's a weird name. Oh, my God. Well, seems to be generating a decent amount of explosions. I mean, it's not <clears throat> bad, I suppose. The only problem I have with this is the the whip is nice because it's guaranteed it goes both sides. This only goes the direction you're facing, which once again is kind of a problem for us because this map is very vertical, not horizontal. And this is a horizontal weapon, so if we were in the library, yeah, yeah, we'd be feeling real good, but we're not, so. Grab this last bit of XP before we get kicked out. Yes, it is 100%. Uh, I noticed that when you stop moving, oh shit, it uh, slows way down. Okay, so now we really, 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 really need to get lucky and get the electric boogaloo, uh, the mad groove at the 11 minute mark. As our arcana. The problem is going to be actually getting the kill though. Because we have to kill it and get the chest before we get engulfed. Oh my god. I can't just ignore this. I also can't just ignore this attract orb. Alright, nice. Um, Take that. Nope, we need to keep running away. 
Yeah, all the XP will make its way to me eventually. Alright, the boss at 11 minutes needs to die so quickly. Um, Bracer is also something we can take, so we'll take it. There should definitely be more XP coming. There has to be more than that. I refuse to believe it. It's just so far down that it's taking a while. Please. Okay, where's the boss? Where's the boss? Where's the boss? There, there, there. You have to die. Okay, okay. This needs to be... This needs to be Mad Groove. Or it's over. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, I thought we weren't going to be able to get it for a second. Okay. Um, uh, we can take Fire Wand for now. Although, do I want to? I'd rather get this leveled up quick. Let's do that. Uh, okay. Good. We got so lucky. Um, now, we need to get Tome still before we grab any of the other shit. But it should be back at 12 minutes. So... All right, we might have a chance now. Although this really seems to be lacking on these explosions. Oh wait, no, they're back. Maybe I just wasn't looking, uh, wasn't paying attention to them enough. Okay, beautiful. This should be a lot of XP, theoretically. Also, after we kill you, we're not grabbing the chest yet. Um, we really need the tome. So that I can grab all this other shit, please. No, I didn't really mean to grab that. Might have needed that later. Yes, Tome is, in my opinion, and maybe even objectively the best one, because I think literally every single thing except for... I think there's a weapon or two. I'm trying to think if I can think of it off the top of my... I think there's one, maybe two weapons that um, aren't affected by the cooldown. Um, I can't think of them off the top of my head. But uh, yes, it is It is uh, really, really, really good. Da -da -da -da. All right, good, good, good. We need this XP, we need it. Fuck. Until I get Tome, I can't get Tiramisu though, so I can't even upgrade these, the guns. Please. They're ready for upgrade and I can't grab them. So what the hell's the... Po oh my god. I can't grab them. What's the point? Oh my god. This is ridiculous. I'm about to start ban uh, banishing other passives. Oh, <gasps> Tome. Oh my god. All my dreams. They're coming true. Whoa. Let's uh, heal up a bit real quick before we go back and get duplicator. Okay, that should be guns. Nice. They're not going to be super effective until we get more tome level ups, but it's, it's at least something. Um, okay, so yes, now we can get Fire Wand, Axe, and Lightning. Or no, Fire Wand, Axe, and Laurel. Also, 
Also, didn't really mean to grab that once again. Might have needed that later. Nice attract orb. Uh, I guess crown, because actually crown's probably really good because getting levels on this character is massive. Life steal coming in clutch. I I need the axe, but it, it, I need the tome. <laughs> I need this cooldown to be faster for this for the guns. Let me see if my curse is increased now. Well, I guess it... No, it still says plus 60. Hmm. I wonder how the curse on Torona's box actually works. I mean, it's, it says it's a cursed object, so I don't know what that means, but... Seems like it's just giving me good shit, so I'm just gonna keep leveling it up. And we gotta get... To, we have to get it to level 9 anyway, so... Oh, what are you? Uh, I've never seen old purple before. That's slightly scary. Not gonna lie. Don't know what you do, and I don't have... Oh, are you casting those spells? I don't have any crosses. Oh, no. Okay. It's fine. This is why we have awake. Some damage in. What is what is happening? What the hell was that? Okay, this purple wizard is actually horrifying. New whip, evolve room, fire. Oh yeah, do all the explosions? We could definitely do that. Although that one explosion, the firecracker one, is a so shit. I hate it. <laughs> Give me the tome. Tome comes first. I really need a cross, though. And I really need these giant wizards to die. Oh! Burn, baby, burn! Uh, can I see the stats? It hasn't. It's still at 60%, which is what it was when I checked earlier. So, I, I don't know. Oh, at level 9, it increases enemy speed, health, quantity, and frequency. Oh! So, at level 9, it basically says here, time to get fucked, bitch. I see. Uh, well, let's wait to upgrade that. Let's wait a little longer. Uh, maybe until we get rid of these, you know, big boys. Oh, okay. We've got, okay. <laughs> uh, what's up, Shav? Hope you're having a good day so far. Good to see you. Good to see you. Um, there's two down. Um, okay, there's Laurel. Also something we needed that we didn't have yet. Okay. All of them are dead. Now it's just this pink wizard guy. Which we probably need a cross for. And we don't have that. There was a misinput, misinput. Calm down! You calm the fuck down! There was a misinput! Did that show up on the screen? God, this community is overreacting. I feel like that should show up, but it didn't. Uh, might have to worry about that later. Um, okay. <sighs> Bracer, I guess. Actually, I need to be upgrading the arrows. I really do. Because I need Laurel and... Oh my god, what is happening? What is happening? What is happening? Hello? I'm a little scared. Oh, that clip hasn't been brought out in a while. Jesus Christ, Galaxy. Um, okay, yes, Silver Ring. Still would really like the last tome, though. 
Okay, yeah, these things, these, these little red guys are, 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 uh, really bad. Really bad for the brand. They are so fast, and I can't get this last, oh, I can't get this last home upgrade to save my life. I can't do it. Holy shit, holy shit. Yeah, it is a classic. That's for... Oh, I timed that so poorly. I'm missing out on half of the XP. That is really, really cool. Fuck. Whatever, we'll get it next time. Okay, we're now up to double chests. But once again, I don't want to grab anything from the chest until I get some of this stuff upgraded. But it takes so long to get shit. Um, like I said, I think I have to just worry about the rings and arrows right now. Like, they're so far away from... And we only have ten minutes left. Oh, wait, was there a cross? Was there? Over here? Although, I don't know where the purple wizard is anyway. Oh, there it is. Oh, there she... Oh, yeah, yeah. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Yeah! Get fucked, bitch. Let's go. Um, I, I want the axe as my last weapon, but... Sorry, axe. There's more important fish to fry. Hmm. Well. I'll take this. Still have another minute until we get the XP teleported, so get as much as we can right now. Fuck. I need the other arrow. No. No. I need the other arrow. Please. I mean, I'm concerned for my health and safety. At 25 minutes is when that big boss is going to spawn that we need to kill. So... Do I just do it? Do I just say fuck? No, I can't. I can't. Not yet. I mean, I need to get it to level 9. And I am getting scared, but I can't do it yet. That's the wrong ring. Damn it. Okay, this is sad. Okay. Big level ups this time. That's not big level ups at all. Ah, fuck. Well... I'm like, oh my god, that's still the wrong ring. It's still the wrong ring. I'm actually just going to do a Laurel upgrade then. And we got one level up. One. Oh boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So at 21 minutes, we'll get the last... Um, last uh, Arcana. Whenever we get that chest. Okay, we're now up to three chests. So maybe I just say fuck it and grab one. I'll say fuck it and grab one. That was worth. I picked the right one, apparently. Yeah, that's totally fine. <laughs> Once again, the more up... That's basically like we just got plus five levels. So we'll take it. Lance it. Ooh, it took a lot of damage here. Whoa, I'm stuck. Oh my god. This is the wrong ring. This is the wrong arrow. Look, the other arrow has two upgrades. The other ring has... Well, I guess the rings are pretty close. But Jesus Christ. This game's just trying to fuck me. Oh my god, this is 
getting a little sick. I'm starting to get nauseous. The game is the game is trying its damnedest to get me out of here, so I can't complete what I these unlocks. Oh wait, is it? Are we at 21 minutes? We are. We are. Which means you are gonna drop the last arcana. And survey says. Well, Waltz of Pearls is only going to affect the Fire Wand. Not very big deal. I think Sarah Band of Healing is frankly the best option. I, I just, I mean, that's, I feel like that's the only option, really. So, we'll double our healing, which makes it even harder for us to die now. Uh, we now deal damage every time we heal. So, I think that's just the best option. The upgraded pinion is nuts. I'm still not a big. I just. I think Studenheim. I. Th I think. I think the reason I don't like it is because of how it works. Like you have to be moving and then you stop and then they like fire off. I don't like that as a mechanic. So I think that's why I'm not a big fan of it. But I also haven't tried it with the uh, Heart of Fire Arcana because that the weapon now explodes with the Heart of Fire. So yeah. You can left click to do it. I guess that's, that would work. I, I don't use my mouse movement a lot, so that would probably be fine. Actually, yes. Bring me my experience, please. Um, do I want to snag that? I don't know if I do. Good news is the XP is starting to funnel in finally. Um, Laurel for sure. Yeah, on the library, I definitely think it'd be really good. Kind of like this new weapon. this These giant whips that I'm throwing out. They'd be very, very good on the library. Not on the library, not quite as good. I mean, they're still putting in work, obviously, but just not... Uh, not the maximum potential at all. I'm not quite ready for the box yet. Once again, I'd like to have at least upgraded like Lancet or Laurel and be close to the other one. It's scary. Because it's not like a little amount. It is going to effectively double enemy speed, health, quantity, and frequency. So, so I, I got to be real careful before we pop it. No, stop, 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 stop. I mean, yeah, because uh, because it affects frequency, it'll inadvertently affect XP, XP, kind of. It depends on how fast... You're going to see a lot more enemies, but it depends on how fast you kill them. Uh, we're just going to get the axe upgrade. Okay, there's Death Spiral. Okay, uh, let's 
Let's try to get Laurel maxed. We're also about to get all the XP teleported to us, which is Pog. That should be at least another level, maybe two, I would think. almost done that is done now gold ring silver silver we're getting there we're very close how close we're in the arrows one two three four one two three one two three we'll see all right once again sooner rather than later would be nice I would like to get the rings done first, because if we get the Lancet, which halves health, then I'll immediately go for the box. Immediately uh, get an upgrade. If we get the Laurel upgraded first, it's still good, but not quite as good. There we go. Keep giving me rings. Finish silver ring first. All right, one more level up. Let's go. There it is, baby. Okay, that should be the upgraded lancet. Perfect. Oh my god, everything is going according to plan. And now we will get tier nine of the box immediately. What the fuck? That thing is tanky. Jeez. Uh, we also now have one extra chest, so... At least I th think so. So we can grab one. Dev watch... Hey, hey. Uh, I ain't gonna... I'm not gonna blame him. I respect it. Okay, there's upgraded Laurel. Okay, we've officially beaten the map. Oh, didn't really mean to grab that, but... We should get at least one more chest, right? I would think. God, we have 11 passives. How sick. Several. Yeah, I, I suppose. There's just no more big bosses left. I don't think, at least. Most maps, the last one is at 25. Okay, this is just a hodgepodge of every enemy in the game they could find. What the hell? I don't even know what I'm looking at. What are these? I'm curious, does this new upgraded whip do more damage the faster you're moving? Like if I was to get wings as a passive, would that would that increase the damage output? Or does it just increase the like speed at which the whip goes in amount? You think it does? So it the the damage actually scales at speed? Interesting. Might have to turn on uh, damage numbers and test it. Later, eventually. Not now, obviously. Oh god, here. There's a bunch of the small ones now. There's the last evolution. Pog. Yeah, this is kind of wild. All the spinning legs are hurting my brain.
120, hell yeah. I mean, there's so much movement on the screen with all those legs that I'm sure the bitrate is torched. Oh yeah, it's torched bad. Oh, we only got two more minutes, don't worry. We'll be out of here soon. Oh my god. They're massive. What the fuck? There's something else up here, wasn't there? Oh, it's an attractor, but it doesn't really matter too much. Yeah, this would be pretty hard to survive under normal circumstances. Like, if you didn't have the evolved Lancet and Laurel, this would be... This would be rough. Yeah, you'd have to have a... Um I'm trying to think of what build you could possibly do. Probably have to be on Leda. Uh, and you'd probably have to go for like what people would normally do for like a high kill build with maybe one weapon traded out for the Lancet. So you could have some freezing. Pentagram potentially if you were playing on Christina. But then you'd have to be playing on Christina. So, so. Because you have to have maximum cooldown you need that proccing like I think with Christina at max cooldown it procs every like 11 seconds or something like that so if you could hold them off for 11 seconds I think you'd be fine I don't know oh hey now we've got all the the rainbow colored uh, deaths for for pride month nice way to go vampire survivors All these game companies just changing their logos on Twitter. Vampire Survivor said, nah, we're gonna put, we're gonna implement it into the game. All right, yeehaw, 30 minutes on the new map. Let's go. It never was even sketchy. I never got worried about it, even for a second. Holy, wait a minute. Wait, these aren't death. Just spawns a bunch of these in. Do these count as kills? Oh, they do. Wow, Pog. Beast thing to do is to be immortal. Yeah, true. Oh. I'm not concerned. We're gonna live through it. We should kill death here soon. In the next 25, 30 seconds or so. I would think. Um, perhaps. Hey, we did. Let's go. We got the two golden. Wait, wait there should be two more. There's one. Yeah, baby. Look at those golden eggs. Yeah, 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 bring Grandpa Reaper out here. Bring Daddy Reaper. Come on. Come for my soul. There, oh, here he is. Here he is. I can't wait to spam the revive button 300 times again.
Those golden eggs were raining on me. Felt like I was at a I was uh, at a male strip club and I was the performer. Oh, it was only twice. Nice. Okay, we unlocked Omni, the foo 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 foo, and hyper version of that map. 